In Creo Parametric 9.0, there is a new model analysis that allows you to create a quilt from the visual field inside of an assembly. It's pretty neat. Let's take a look at how to use it. Here I am in an assembly model that is a combine or a harvester, and I want to see what the operator sees through the windshield. Let's go to the analysis tab. Now on the right hand side of the ribbon, you'll see in the safety group, there's a new visual field command. Let's click on it and that will open up the dashboard for the command. And here we're going to select the eye point. I created a datum point at the assembly level to, to represent the eye point. I will click on it. Then we have what we're going to look at or through. I will pick the windshield part with the left mouse button. And now we can start seeing the quilt that would end up being constructed from that particular location. Right now, it is a view distance by value. If you go to the drop down list, you can change that to by reference. And we have a value here that is around 1800. That's roughly about six feet. Let's crank this up. Let's use 3000 millimeters, which is about 10 feet or crank it up even more, let's use 4,500, which is about 15 feet. So you can see the extent of the visual field. But there are different objects inside of the cab that are going to obstruct the operator's view. So we can select different obstructing objects. Now I'm gonna pick them out of the model tree. Let me select the cab structure, I'll click on that and it starts making some changes. Let me hold down the control key to select the wipers in the middle. And by the way, when I selected the cab structure, you can start to see, especially at a distance, how the operator's steering column is going to end up blocking the view, especially out at a distance. And let's add in a couple more components. Let me grab that part of the cab. Let's also grab the roof. And when I click on the roof, you can see again how it adjusted the field of vision. And let me click in the excluded objects collector just so that all the obstructing objects are no longer highlighted. So if there are certain items, say in the cab structure or the roof, that I did not want to contribute to the construction of the quilt, I could exclude them from the analysis. And this looks good. Be aware that you can create multiple cones within this visual field feature, but I'm happy with this one. Let's hit the check mark. And now we have the visual field created so we can see with this quilt what the operator would be capable of seeing at a distance.